Hi. <laughs> I feel so awkward today. I don't know. I mean, <laughs> I'm not used to 10k people. <laughs> I'm feeling kind of shy. <laughs> so, um, I have been craving a pina colada for literally so long. It's like if a holiday was a drink, I feel like it would be a pinus colada. Travel, holidays, none of that's really happening right now. So yeah, we're gonna make a pinus colada and talk about life because there's 10k of us now and you know what better way to get to know people than share a drink together so i asked you guys on instagram to ask me some questions holy that's a lot of questions okay let's start with how many languages do you speak i speak english obviously english is my first language russian because my mom's russian and urdu i speak urdu because well my dad's pakistani so um three languages what are your thoughts on new zealand being a corona free state well, to be honest, I'm not surprised. New Zealand is a tiny country and they handle these things pretty well. But it makes me sad. <laughs> I just put in some coconut cream. I think four tablespoons is like enough. You know what? Let's put five. Let's put five. Where were you born? Okay, this one's a bit weird. I was born in Japan. But no, I'm not Japanese. No, I do not speak Japanese. I mm, mm. I was born there because my dad used to work there at the time. And then two months after I was born, I moved to New Zealand. So I, I have like basically no association with Japan other than the fact that I was born there. Do you miss Nixer? No. <laughs> if you could move anywhere else in the world except Pakistan or New Zealand to settle, where would you go? I would go to i'd go to canada i've never even been to canada but i i love canada like I, I don't know why what do you miss the most about life in new zealand and do you regret the move i miss literally everything straight up there is nothing about new zealand that i don't miss but i probably miss my friends the most and i really miss how like easy everything is you know what i mean like can this stupid car shut up? For example, if I wanted to go for a walk, I wouldn't like I wouldn't have to think about it. Like I could just walk out of my house. You can't really do that here. I mean, you can, but you kind of have to have like someone come with you for safety reasons and stuff. That's just one little example, but I just I mean like just in general, I miss like the ease of life. Anyway, so I just added some orange juice in this. I hate orange juice, but you kind of need it for flavor in pina colada, but I'm talking about like just plain orange juice on its own. I just think it's so gross. Like, it all started. I think that's enough. I need to ask my mom. Give me a sec. Mother dearest told me that's enough. I'm just gonna add some sugar now. Oh, I forgot to answer the second part of that question. Do I regret the move? I can't regret it because it wasn't my decision in the first place. I had literally nothing to do with the decision. But if you mean would I not move, then yeah, I probably would stay in New Zealand. But you know, now that I've had this experience here, despite how difficult it has been, the past couple of years that I spent here, there's been a lot of personal growth that I perhaps wouldn't have had if I was still in New Zealand so in that sense I do believe that this happened for a reason however I do still really want to go back if you like pina coladas let me tell you guys a funny story so I don't know why I do this but I say pinus colada a lot it happens subconsciously I don't know why if you want to unsubscribe you can I was at a cafe or something once and the guy comes to take my order and I'm just like yeah so can I please have a pinus colada and then that guy he kind of just like looks at me and he's just like look at these we're gonna take the pink one actually this is red I'm a little bit blind oh shit Wow, I really feel like I'm sitting in the Maldives right now. I'm in Bora Bora. I'm in the Bahamas. I am... I am sad. <laughs> you know what would be funny? If you guys were actually drinking something right now. If anyone's got a drink with them right now, take a photo of it and put it on your story and tag me. And yeah, we'll just, we'll just...
Do you dye your hair? Yes, I dye my hair. In fact, I actually dyed it literally an hour ago. So if I look a little bit like a banana today, it's because I have been able to tone it properly. My hair is the color of my panas colada. Okay, this question is the most asked question. Why did you move to Pakistan? <sighs> I don't want to answer this right now. Aww. Basically, the reason for why I moved is something that I have a lot to say about and it's a topic that I feel needs to be addressed. So I do want to make a separate video about that at some point. But I am gonna just let you guys know that I did not move here by choice. I just want to clear that up. A lot of people blame me for moving here, but honestly, it was not my decision whatsoever. I just had to deal with it and I just had to embrace it. And that is what I'm doing and that is what I continue to do. When is living in Pakistan part two coming? out well let me show you I'm working on editing this like right now so it'll be out very soon i'm gonna give you guys a little sneak peek <laughs> everyone who's asked me which software i use to edit i use final cut pro so yeah anyway so the real purpose of filming this very spontaneous video to be honest i don't even know what to say i'm so blown away guys i in this past week, we're now at 10k. Never mind, I just checked. We're at 11k. How did we hit another k in a day? Guys! I was at 2k and then I kind of just blinked for like a second and then we were at 9k and then this morning I woke up and we were at 10 and now we're at 11. I'm like, oh! Thank you. Like, thank you to each and every one of you. You guys are fantastical, okay? <laughs> like, nothing makes my day more than hearing someone tell me that they relate to my content or that my videos, you know, inspire them. It just like makes my heart all like warm and fuzzy. Thank God for this, God bless, honestly, and thank all of you guys so much. Okay, bye. <laughs> what a wonderful